Regular meeting of the Township of Ocean Planning Board. Please come to order. Please call the roll. Here. 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 We stand for the salute to the flag. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. The notice requirements of the open public meeting law for this meeting have been satisfied. A copy of the notice has been sent to the Asbury Park Press and the coaster and filed in the office of the Township Clerk on July 19th, 2019. Emergency notice is an emergency exit through the courtroom doors and two exits at the rear of the room. Please note that no smoking laws are in effect here. Also note board policy. No new cases will be started after 10.30 p.m. and no new testimony taken after 11 p.m. Also, please note all meetings will be video and audio taped and shown in the Township of Ocean's Community Cable Channel, Channel 22 on the Rising Fires, and Channel 77 on Cablevision. All cell phones must be turned off. If you need to make a call, please make a call outside the meeting room. First item of business is a minutes for approval of the meeting of October 7th, 2019. Would someone offer it, please? I offer. For a second? I second. Call the roll. Yes. 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 Next time is a res next item is a resolution memorialization. Deal thirty five land LLC block thirty three lot nineteen point oh one sixteen oh three state highway thirty five ocean. <coughs> Someone offer it, please. I offer. I second. Call the roll. Objection. 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 You can't be heard unless you come up to the microphone. Absolutely. Okay. Identify yourself, please. No, there it goes. Had a warm up. David Weiner, 1216 Walnut Avenue, Ocean Township. My objection is that the um, memorialization that you're about to take a vote on tonight has not been afforded the general public for its edification. And, and before you shake your head, if I may, you may shake your head, of course, but if I may, is it this position of the board, and in particular I'd like some backup from Mr. Brown, since it's his expertise in the legal end of it, that the board is not required to either publish or allow a resident of the township to view this memorialization before it's voted upon? The uh, <clears throat> public hearing has been closed. The interaction with the public is closed. Uh, the resolution of memorialization is merely an administrative step that's being taken. Uh, I have talked to uh, uh, Mr. Kirk, and the resolution will be um, on the web tomorrow morning for public to tomorrow review. Tomorrow by the end of business tomorrow. But uh, the, um, uh, the only purpose of the resolution of memorialization is to determine if the members who voted in favor of the application uh, are satisfied uh, with the language. So therefore the public has no right to check the language for its correctness and anything else contained within that document. Is that what you're maintaining for the record? Yes. All right. Thank you. Call cool the roll, please. Uh, Jackie Wenzel, 610 Deal Road. I was advised that um, something very similar to what David just said, that the 
at this point that the there has been an approval that there is this resolution um, that the public has a right to read it. So I know you're posting it now, but you're going to be posting it post you agreeing. So I would like to request that you postpone your approval of this this evening till the public has an opportunity to read it, because at times there are errors in it. And if there are errors, then we can discuss them at that time. I'd like to make that request. The requirements are for the board members who voted in favor of the resolution to review it and to vote on it. It's not up to the public to make any corrections or whatever they may find on it. So that's... Uh, but how will we know if there are errors if it's the, the people that are not voting not, on it's it? It's not up to you to determine. It's up to the people who are voting on it to determine if there are any, quote, errors in it. But there's public portions to the meeting because you do engage the public to have an so opinion on it. The public portion's been closed. We're up to the voting of the memorialization now. There's no... Even the comments you're making now... Well, it was given to me from someone who's uh, on a planning board in Monmouth County. So okay. it may, is Ocean Township okay. different from Monmouth County in terms of those rules? Well, okay. Is it? Your, your comments are noted. Okay. Then I have another question. Um, everyone who's voting tonight was not at the planning board meetings, not every one of the planning board the only, meetings. As I said a minute ago, if you pay attention, the only people eligible to vote are the ones who were at the meetings and who voted in favor of the resolution of the uh, resolution at the meeting. I wasn't but they're not all here. I'm not voting on it. Uh, maybe one or two other people who were sitting here are not going to vote on it. The only but they're not all here, the ones that voted yes. The, uh, the, the, the only thing that the statute says that, that uh, when merely a revel resolution and memorialization is before the board, those who voted in favor uh, of the resolution are permitted to vote. As a matter of fact, if there was only one person who was here, which is not the case, but in the extreme, if only one person was here who voted in favor of it, that person can vote. Uh, and if that person votes that the resolution and memorialization is in line with what the decision was, that passes. That's very clear under the MLUL. If only one person voted yes and they all voted no, but just the one person yes is here, then yeah, it goes let through? Me, let me try to explain this to you one more time. Well, okay. that would be good. And, and please don't be rude with me. I'm not being rude with you. Well, me. you're I'm being a little bit. A little trying, bit. I'm trying to disrespectful. Explain. First of all, you pay attention to this. This, this is really Come on. This is not Come on. You've got to please even stop be this. Allowed. This is not something right. for the public. This is an administrative please. matter. It is merely a vote that is very technical in nature and is to determine if those who voted in favor of it. Uh, feel that the language of the resolution memorialization fits in with the, the voting. Well, I was told that everyone voting has to, that we, it, it has to be shown to the public that everyone that voted yes had attended every meeting, and I don't believe that the evening of the vote everyone had attended every meeting. That, if you feel you have an issue on appeal, that's certainly your right, but at this point in time, the vote was taken, and there were six affirmative votes, as I remember. So those who are here tonight that were part of those six who voted, those are only the people who will consider this and vote on it. Okay, but, but um, I guess, can I ask you this one question? There's if no, for everyone that voted, did no, they watch me, every meeting? Did me. they see every meeting? Excuse me. Yes, of course. There's no yes, bias. and they did? And they signed off on it, Estelle? No. Because the legality of it is, you see it and you sign off on it. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Would you please call the roll? Yes. 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 Thank you. Next item on on the agenda: the following cases will not be heard tonight in carry to our next meeting of November twenty fifth, twenty nineteen. Mamano, Block 33.14, Lot 2, 710 West Park Avenue, Ocean. Scott Delaney, Block 35, Lot 5, 1206 West Park Avenue, Ocean. 1111 Highway 35, LLC, Block 209, Lot 8, 1111, Highway 35 in Ocean. This will serve as public notice. No further notice is required. Bring this to the only case on our agenda tonight called Sunset Arcadia, LLC. Block 187, lots 1.02 and 5, 1100 Route 35 Ocean. This is an application for minor site plan approval with variances for 
two signs over maximum square footage and a variance for a sign in the front yard setback. Mr. Falvo. <laughs> put that in the, the we'll put that in the here. budget for next year. <laughs> <laughs> Just for you. We'll call it the Peter Fowler chair. <laughs> Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Good uh, evening. This matter was heard. Excuse me, one minute. Take your time. I don't back up as well as I used to. Take your time. <laughs> this matter was heard on the 23rd of September. <laughs> And the only reason it wasn't brought to a vote that evening is that we had an issue with service on uh, two of the utilities, uh, the state of New Jersey and one of the utilities. So we carried it until this evening so we could service them. We sent the notices out again as per the addresses on the tax collector's list. And lo and behold, we corrected the spelling of the word boulevard and it still came back as undeliverable at that address. But we satisfied the requirements of the statute. Uh, I have my clients here tonight if anybody has any questions, but I would ask that the board would consider the jurisdiction noon prom took going back to the September 23rd meeting and I would ask for a favorable vote on the resolution. Mr. Chairman, real quick, I just would like to put on the record that I did listen to the tape and am eligible. Oh, okay, sure. thank you very much, John. Right. Thank you. So for uh, purposes of uh, the record, uh, Mr. Falvo did indicate at the September meeting, uh, the minutes we just passed upon, that he was going to ask for the vote for tonight. And I have seen the proofs, and they uh, do represent what Mr. Falvo just stated. And so... Um, uh, jurisdiction uh, not pro tonk has been yes. maintained, and uh, you know, the the hearing was not closed on purpose Correct. to ask for uh, the vote tonight for obvious jurisdictional reasons. So we can have uh, uh, the board members ask any questions if they want, or you can refer back to the minutes and your recollection from September. Anyone from the board have any questions or concerns? Anyone from the public have any questions? So I'm going to make a motion to close the public hearing. So moved. Second. Okay. Call the roll. <coughs> yes. 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 Okay. So, Mr. Falvo, all those who voted uh, were at the September uh, yes. meeting, except for Mr. Duthie, who uh, has listened and actually watched yes, the proceeding. So, so, thank so you. congratulations. Mr. DeFiglia moved it. Who seconded we'll move the, the motion? The, uh, I did. Thank you, Mr. Dr. Badena. Oh, you're moved? quite welcome. Someone move it? Mr. Falvo. I move it. You second? I second. Call the roll. Thank you very much. Wait, wait, wait. We, gotta, we, gotta we didn't vote away. yet. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I thought you were... Yes. 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 Good luck, Mr. Falvo. You know about Thank you. publishing. Thanks. Good to see you back. That's it, folks. The meeting's adjourned.